You know, someone just mentioned to me, um, you know, that he, they're very proud of me and, and the way that I'm representing Penn State. And, you know, um, you know, I'm proud to be a part of the Penn State family. I'm proud to, you know, have been, you know, accepted, you know, with all the things that I've been through um, and still be, you know, smiling, you know, at the end of the day. So, you know, I, I'm going to go out there and represent Penn State, the 49ers, my family, you know, everyone. Um, and just, you know, go out there and just give, you know, the best show I can give. Penn State was a blessing to me. I mean, I, I had to work extremely hard for what I got. And uh, I wasn't a three, four year starter. And uh, for not being a three year, four year starter and being here, it's such a blessing. And God's been kind to me. And uh, to be at the top, top of the league at playing the Super Bowl, um, it's a hard feeling to describe. Nevertheless, it still left a profound impact on me. Uh, you know, working with Coach Paterno was was uh, was great for me. Uh, certainly, um, did a tremendous job in, in uh, understanding how you go about preparing a team to win. Um, it was a great education for me because just before I went to Wake Forest as a head coach, that I had a great uh, platform to build upon. So, um, you know, that experience there at Penn State was invaluable for me in terms of my coaching career. Um, it's exciting, man. You know, I figured it'd be like this. Everything that I that I expect. Uh, but, you know, at the end of the day, uh, my high school coach used to say on things like homecomings, you know, everyone comes out and want to go to parade and, and do all the festivities. But at the end of the day, they remember who won or lost the game, you know. So that, at the end of the day, that's the, the most important thing. And um, that's what I'm focused on.